Dear friends, today we are in desperate need for deliverance, and I do believe we have hope that deliverance is on the way. Our Savior, the lover of our souls, the Lord Jesus Christ, who shed holy blood on the cross to cleanse our sin, he has saved us by his grace, and whether we live and are raptured or die for Christ, Jesus Christ is faithful to all that he has promised. Keep your eyes focused on him. And I'm looking at reasons to be consider a rapture for this Passover season. Passover starts tomorrow, April 5th, in the evening. And tomorrow in the daytime is the fast of the firstborn. And as we go from the Revelation 12 sign, 9-2-3-17 to April 5th, 2023 is 2020 days and Strong's 2020 in Hebrew is Hatzalah used in Esther 4.14 and it is deliverance and we are at this day, dear friends, in desperate need of deliverance and it just so happens, dear friends, that the very theme of Passover is deliverance and um, we have reason to hope, dear friends, that deliverance is coming. God's Arrange this, I believe, in Strong's Concordance, uh, many, many other things that have come up, brethren. Um, I mean, just the very fact that we have this astounding sign and connecting the Passover and the word coming up in Strong's as deliverance, dear friends, with everything converging right now, dear friends, I think that we have reason to hope. And the greatest reason is not the, these uh, numbers in Strong's or number of days, but we see everything converging Right now, we see everything coming together. And uh, Israel's the number one sign there. We saw, they say Israel's the hour hand, Jerusalem's the minute hand, and the Temple Mount is the second hand. And then the convergence of all things coming together. The stage is being set for the book of Revelation to unfold. We are in desperate need of deliverance. Even as we uh, consider that and... Uh, and April 5th starts Passover week, and then April 7th is Good Friday, remembering Jesus died on the cross. When Jesus died, there is that verse that says that some of those who were dead raised up. So maybe, a, maybe that's a sign that a resurrection and rapture will happen on Good Friday, maybe. And then we have April 9th coming up, which is the great resurrection day. Jesus Christ rose from the dead. He conquered sin, death, and hell. He is the King of kings, and He is the Lord of lords. He is in control of the universe. That's one reason why we say Revelation 12, it talks about the child being in danger and the dragon at the foot of the woman to, de to devour at the moment it's born. We know when Jesus um, ascended to heaven, He was uh, not in danger. He was in total control of the universe. And the Bible says the child was snatched up to God into his throne, snatched up in, a, in, in the context in deliverance from the dragon who was at it, the feet of the woman to devour that child. And we believe that will be the rapture of the church. And G, that, uh, so we're remembering that great resurrection morning and Passover itself being a great day of deliverance. God showing in a dramatic way that he was delivering his people. And dear friends, today we are in desperate need of deliverance. And to Good Friday from the Revelation 12 sign is 2,023 days in, in 2023. That's another interesting thing, I just say. And then uh, Strong's 2020 in Greek, Epiphosco, is to dawn. This could be the dawning of the great and glorious morning. And in 20, Strong's 2020 in Hebrew, Hatzala. Deliverance. We are hoping for, we're in desperate need of deliverance right now, dear friends. Many, many things uh, pointing to the fact that we are in desperate need of deliverance, but I'll give you just one point here from this uh, video by Watchman Dan. Hi there, guys. God bless you and thank you for checking in. Well, this video literally sums it all up for me. Senate Bill 686 gives the World Economic Forum full control over america gives citizens 20 years in prison for dissent guys this is extraordinary i'm not going to add to this video this guy's uh, report is absolutely phenomenal i can't add to that um, i would just say however that on our channel here you will find a lot of information around the demonic one world government which is so dear friends 
We're in desperate need of deliverance right now. And the Lord bless you all. Jesus Christ is coming soon. We have reason to hope. And this video here is... Uh, yeah, this, this, this bill he's talking about is called the Restrict Act, Senate Bill 686. And by what they're saying, it's a complete and total disaster. You know, they uh, vote on bills. They don't even know what's in them. So, uh, we, Lord, deliver us. Deliver us. And we just come to you, Lord Jesus, and we thank you for all that you've given us and all that you've done for us for the years and the times you've given us to have the privilege to share the gospel. We pray the people here in our voice here today, Lord, that they will be blessed, that they'll be drawn close to you, they'll be filled with joy, filled with peace, and Lord, that uh, the power of the blood of Christ uh, will will be manifest to them, Lord, that they'll, that they'll know the cleansing and the peace that comes from the cleansing of the blood of Christ, and that they'll be filled, Lord, with your spirit to have power to witness today. I mean, we might, Lord, as, as, as we don't know how long we have to, to witness, but even as we have this day, bless the body of Christ to witness for you and for your glory and uh, bless them to tell the story. Bless them to tell the story, the story that is your story. His story is his story, the story of Jesus Christ, our Savior. Lord, fill everyone here with the power of your spirit to proclaim the good news and the kingship and the glory of the lordship of Jesus Christ and the power of his blood to cleanse sin. Are you a sinner in need of cleansing? Well, the blood of Jesus was shed. For all sinners who would come to Christ, all sinners who will turn to Christ, they will find grace and mercy and cleansing. And Jesus Christ rose from the dead. He conquered sin, death, and hell. And he is coming again soon, dear friends. Today is the day of salvation. Dear friends, I believe we have reason to hope that it's soon. And in this Passover season, we have April 5th to April 13th being Passover week. And then we have second Passover coming up in May. So, dear friends, let's hope. Let's hope. But uh, only God knows for sure the day and the hour. And we keep occupied until he comes. The Lord bless you all. Jesus Christ is coming soon. Amen.